guys. Uh, I want to tell a quick story about a prank that I pulled on my little brother Ben. I had this old uh, Volvo that didn't have an air condition and it didn't have a heater. Uh, I didn't have the money to fix these things, but at the time I was a teenager and it didn't really it didn't really matter to me that they didn't work. I could roll down the windows during the summer and I could uh, bundle up during the winter. Uh, and this Volvo had a really nice feature. Uh, with the flip of a button, you could have heated seats. I mean, it wasn't a great car, but, you know, your bum could be nice and toasty if you flipped a switch. My brothers didn't know about this because I kind of discovered it by accident and then just kind of never told anyone. But I was riding, uh, riding somewhere with my brother Ben in the, in the summer, and uh, I, I flipped the switch to the, to the heated seat under, <laughs> under him. And after a while, he started to complain about the heat. You know, and I, I was keeping a straight face and was like, oh, that feels great in here. I mean, you know, I, mean, I know it's hot, but I, I don't have a working air conditioner, so you're just going to have to suffer until we get to where we've got to go. And uh, he was just wiggling around in his seat, and he was like, no, I swear to you, it feels like this, I feel like I'm on fire. And, uh, you know, I tried to stay as straight faced as I could. I was like, you know what, I'm sorry, I, I don't have a working air conditioner. I mean, just stick your head out the window if it's that bad. And, uh... Well, anyway, after a while, I couldn't keep a straight face anymore, and uh, <laughs> he finally caught on, and he was like, what are you doing there? Do you have the heater on? What's going on here? And finally, I was like, the seat's, the seat's heated, and, you know. Anyway, that was just uh, one of the quick pranks that I pulled on my brother. I've pulled quite a few on, on my brothers throughout the years, but um, I just wanted to tell that story and to say, hi, Ben. <laughs> Anyway, uh, thanks for listening, and uh, bye.